welcome back to my channel. So today, I'm going to be trying the AG Care. <coughs> Guys, I'm getting over a cold, so bear with me, okay? So I have a little coughing fit here in there, alright? But I'm going to be trying the AG Care hair care line. So I was like, you know what? I was just going to get the gel. Right? The mousse gel. I was like, what? A mousse and a gel? Now, you know, guys, I used to be a mousse girly when it came to the wash and goes, but I switched into gels because, you know, I don't know, it's just my hair agrees more with it. It lasts longer. You know, I don't mind the crunch because the crunch goes away. But a mousse gel, I don't know. Something about this just was like, let's try it. So I bought it. These products are expensive, okay? I'm going to show you how much each product is in a minute. Watch. And then I was like, you know what? Let me just do a whole review. So let me get a shampoo and conditioner. So that's what I did. So this is the conditioner. It is the Curl Fresh Coconut Avocado <coughs> Conditioner. So hopefully it smells good. And then I got the shampoo. But it says it's pea and rice complex for moisturizing and defined curls. I don't know. I never had peas in a hair care product before. I never had should be interesting now these are all vegan products so they say yeah vegan and cruelty free you see I ain't lying right here so we'll see I haven't tried these products out before so very first time oh, I hate when I do that very first time trying these products out so now let me tell you right the shampoo was 27 dollars and 20 cents the conditioner was 27 dollars and 20 cents the damn mousse was 22 40 um 22 dollars and 40 cents that's a lot okay it's probably like if i do my math right like around like 80 something maybe 90 guys that's a lot for fucking three products and there's no even deep conditioner so hopefully <coughs> hopefully this these products work for my hair because um, that's a lot of money. Now, I really just, I want to try this because this is really what this video is about, okay? This is this is the main star. This, this is the main star, okay? The other two, I just wanted to give it a try, okay? Um, so, some concerns I have. I feel like this won't define my hair because the mousse part of it. That's one concern about this, about the mousse shells with the mousse part. I feel like it won't define my hair like it needs to. Okay, now for the shampoo, shampoo, shampoo. Like it, it's going to clean my hair anyways. It's just how clean is it going to get. But my real concern is the conditioner. Does this have slip? Is there a slip in this bitch? Because am I going to have trouble detangling? Because it says nothing. Like I'm reading the direction. It says nothing about slip and nothing. Okay, it says massage into hair and rinse. Is this product made for me? Like, this, like, when I was doing reviews about, like, when I was trying to do, like, what is that, research about this product, you know, when I try out hair products, I try to figure out if it's, if it's for me. Because why am I wasting my money if it's not for me? I'm not just going to try hair products to try it. Like, if it's not for me, I'm not going to try it. Like, let's make it make sense. I'm not wasting my money. Like, I don't, your girl broke, so we, I don't need to be wasting money like that. So, I didn't really, like, I didn't really see a lot of, People, you know, my people use this. Um, I see my people use this. And that's like barely, okay? This, I don't know. Um, so hopefully, you know, this reminds me of the Curl Smith because it's vegan free and cruelty free. And I love the Curl Smith. So hopefully, this is just, but this is so expensive. It's too expensive. It's too expensive. I mean, I guess they give you a good 12 ounce, like, I guess. But, I like the design. I'm not going to hold you. It's simple. It's nice, you know. Um, I don't really know what the different colors mean. Like, this is purple and this is green. I don't really know. Um, so, that. This, from like, color thing reminds me of the texture ID. You feel me? Like, maybe each color has different hair textures involved with it. I don't know. I don't know. But, guys. Hey, my face is getting a little clearer. You see the hair? The hair is growing. Like, but I don't think my hair is growing that much because look at how much color I have left in my hair. And I feel like I've been growing my hair for a while. Guys, I'm thinking about cutting my hair. 
I know, I know. I'm really just thinking about cutting all the color off and just, you know, going black. Because, you know, I just feel like my hair was really 4C hair. For real, for real. I can't find my old photos, but I'm going to try to put some photos. But my, four, my hair was 4C hair. Like, my brother's hair that he has is what I used to have. And I want it back because I'm jealous of his hair. I'm going to put a picture of his hair somewhere here. Let me tell you guys, his hair, chef's kiss. Like, jealousy is not even a word. Like, why do guys have, like, some of the best features? Like, give me. You don't even need it. I'm thinking about doing a couple of things. Think about starting dreads. Think about cutting my hair. Like, oh, guys, guess what? Guess what? Your girl got accepted to a nursing school. Like fall 2024 girls, I mean fall 2024 guys, I'm gonna be in nursing school. So that's also when I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with my hair. If I want to cut it, dread it, because you know what? Once I get to that nursing school, I'm gonna bug it down, and it's gonna be hard. Okay, so I need to focus. I can't be. But don't cry, don't cry. Okay, guys, don't cry. Because when I do go to nursing school, I'm still gonna try to record a video for you guys. Okay, like I'm not gonna forget about you guys. You guys are my part time job. I. Right? per diem when nursing school starts per diem okay but right now you guys are full time might take a back seat when i go to school but i'm not gonna forget about you guys but bear with me okay okay like i am so excited because i applied to like six seven nursing schools and i got accepted and well i got accepted to like four including the school that i'm going to but the other ones were far away this one this the one that i got accepted to i can drive there it's cheaper i can afford it a little bit like just excitement because you go with stressing okay stress and i try not to stretch because it sews in my face so i try not to you know i try not to stretch i'm not i try not to stretch stretch stress about certain things so you know i could just keep my aura calm and collected you feel me like i don't like anything disturbing my peace and stressing me out so fun fact about me all right guys fun fact. okay so i'm gonna set up get you guys set up and face you guys to my shower so i can wash my hair because my hair has not listen guys a lot's been happening my hair has not been washed for i think like two three weeks maybe a month i don't know okay it's been a while okay a lot has happened um i did a video for you guys i did i did a, a review on the michi's hairline but it didn't go as planned because i recorded the wash day and stuff and i styled my hair and everything guys and then i got sick like when i tell you sick like i was sick for a week a week straight just sick and dying like i was literally on my bed sick and dying like i had chills i had the fever i had a cough my throat was bugging i had a headache like <coughs> i was going hence the cough it stayed i was going through a lot okay i was sick dying and i did the review for you guys but then um i went to sleep and I didn't do the band method with my hair. So when I woke up, my hair was crazy. Like if I, I'll try to put it here somewhere for you guys, looking how I was looking, my hair was crazy. So I just threw away the whole video. Okay. I'm going to see, I'm going to try to do it again for you guys. Because honestly, I forgot like um, how I really felt initially about the video because it's been so long and I've been going through so much. So I'm just gonna do it again for you guys so you guys can get my honest review because honestly I didn't I forgot what I didn't like and what I did like about the product line. So that video will be coming. Maybe because I don't really want to try that product line again because I didn't like most of the products. But I'll, if you guys want a Michi video, I think I'm saying it right, then I will give it to you guys, okay? Y'all can comment down below if y'all want me to do it and get my reaction of it you know that's up to you guys if you guys don't want it i won't do it because i don't really care for that line but i'll probably do the mousse in the tropical gel that they have oasis tropical oasis gel that one the limited edition one i'll probably do that one because i did buy that one so y'all let me know what y'all want in the comments but we're gonna get into this video thank you guys for listening to my rants love y'all um 
So to the shower we go. Small like it has maybe like a peppermint or tea tree. I don't know. Oh, actually, I'm not mad at the way it's going on. Peas and rice, though. It's like it's thick, huh? I'm not mad at it. Definitely some water though. One wash and I don't know my hair feels weird. I don't know how to put it. Huh. Let me see guys. I don't know how I feel about this product. Um I don't know. Ooh, I don't know. Like I was trying to read the ingredients to see if there's like um silicone in it because usually when there's like silicone in products my hair usually reacts like this but I couldn't I was trying to read it fast but from what I see I didn't see no silicone I don't know like this is so weird I don't know if I like it or not that's the thing I'm trying to figure out this feels like when a product has silicone in it I don't know, my hair doesn't, I don't know guys, something in the shampoo, my hair is not, I don't think my hair is really, I don't know, it feels just funny. There's definitely like a lot of um, oils on this product because my hair does feel tingly. I'll put the ingredients somewhere for you guys to see, but. You know this feels like guys, it feels like African black soap. Because when I wash my hair with African black soap, this is what it feels like sometimes. But it is like clarifying my hair. I'll give you that. Like it's it's not moisturizing at all. It's very um it strips your hair of the moisture your hair does have. I'll say that. But it's not a bad shampoo. I just don't like how it feels on my hair personally, guys. I don't know. Have you guys tried the AG? What is it? Curl Fresh? <laughs> Curl in Enhancing Shampoo? Have y'all tried that? The Peas and Rice Complex? Um, let me know down in the comments because do you guys also experience this? Like, I don't know. I feel like maybe it could just like strip my hair of the moisture. That's why I feel so like, you know. But it's really moisturizing. Not not moisturizing. It is very clarifying. There you go. I'll say that. Like, huh. maybe I just have to get used to. But I don't like my hair feeling stripped. I like when the shampoo adds moisture to the hair. But it's not bad because it actually is cleaning my scalp. Hair does feel clean. So, if you're the type of girl that likes a clarifying shampoo, this shampoo is for you. And one that suds up. It's for you. So this one, it suds up and it clarifies. I don't know how the conditioner is going to work, but right now, just from using the shampoo, I might need to get a deep conditioner in my hair. But we're going to give it a try, you know, and see what the conditioner is about. Because if the conditioner is hydrating, then hey. But the shampoo is very clarifying, I'll say that. And it has a little tingly feeling to it. It cleansed the hell out of my hair. My hair feels like it's tangled to the max. We'll see. So now I'm going to be applying the conditioner. Let's see what this is giving. Okay, it's thick. Let's give it a smell test. This is what it looks like. Okay. 
coconut. It smells like coconut. Oh, I love it good. I have high hopes for the conditioner. It seems like my hair is gonna like it. It seems like it's just gonna melt in my hair. I think my hair's gonna like this. Oh, yeah. The conditioner, guys. I think, I think so. Maybe not gas it up too much, not yet. But this smells fantastic. Yeah. Coconut and avocado oil. Yes, ma'am. I like to drench my hair conditioner, if you haven't noticed. Now, when you put it on your hand, it doesn't give slip. Like, it doesn't give slip. But when it goes on the hair, it feels like it can give slip. I would say it feels a little moisturizing, a little bit, but it didn't say anything about moisturizing, which was also one of my concerns. It says define strengthen curls with a nutrient-rich avocado, coconut, and ooh, sunflower seed oil and a creamy mango butter base using this 98% plant base. Hmm, mango butter. Okay. I didn't even know I had all that in there. I think I like this one, guys. Let me try detangling it now to see what it's gonna give if I believe it. It doesn't say to leave it in your hair for like a five, ten minutes. It doesn't say none of that. But I'm gonna see if we need to do that or not. And guys, my hair needs to trim so bad. So bad, so bad. But I think for this condition, in order for me to actually detangle my hair, I'm going to have to turn on the water just so... Because it's really thick and it took all the water out of my hair. So I think I'm going to need the water's help. Oh, 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 see? No, no, no. It's a no for the conditioner, guys. As y'all can see, I had to rinse it out. I'm gonna go find my deep conditioner, and I'll be right back. Okay, so for the con deep conditioner, I'm gonna need you the TGIN Rose Water Hydrating Mask because mm -mm. no man. I ain't got a clue, bro. I like my hair soaking wet when I apply thick product just so my hair can absorb it better. Because this deep conditioner is stuck. But this is like one of my favorite guys. <laughs> favorite deep conditioner, deep mask or whatever, mask treatment on the hair. One of my favorites. See how it's already just like. Breaking up the curls? I mean, the, the tangle? Look at it. Yeah, because that conditioner was not doing it, guys. It was not. Mm -mm. But to be honest, to give the conditioner probably like a fair chance, I think the shampoo fucked it up. Because when my hair gets too, like, clarified and, like, whatever, my hair just gets tangled to the max. So that conditioner did not stand a chance. But I put a shower cap, leave this on for like a good 10 minutes, then come back. Okay, guys? Alright guys, so my hair feels nice and soft. Thank God for the TGIN Rose Water Hydrated Mask. Forever, my OG. Okay, because now my hair is detangled. My hair was really knotted and I only think because it was too clarifying for my hair. You guys might like it, but <coughs> if you guys like, like a, a deep, deep clarifying shampoo with me, I like in the middle, like I like it to clarify but then moisturize my hair at the same time. Mm -mm, that one just stripped everything. Okay, and it made my hair tangled, knotted, and everything. But the deep conditioner helped. We're gonna try a Zemus gel. Like, I'm really excited for this one. This product alone. So, I didn't put nothing in my hair, no leave in, just because I don't know how it's gonna react. And I just wanna try this mousse by itself. And when I was doing research, I was trying to figure out if people used um, 
like any leave-ins with the product and i couldn't find anything and on here it doesn't say anything like it doesn't say like you know how the depth foam mousse is like use it by itself this one doesn't say anything like that so it says shake can dispense in hand and work through clean and damped hair diffuse air dry okay so shake oh guys i am so nervous oh, my hair feels so nice that hair mask like guys look at like if i just chop this off like would y'all be mad that's a lot of hair it's like maybe like five inches four inches that's a lot of hair but like they would have to cut it like this because <sighs> so we're gonna dump the hair make sure it's detangled i'm so nervous Ooh, they didn't say how much to use but i feel like it's wow okay it smells sweet i don't know if i like that smell though I've been wondering all day. I'm gonna put less next time. It feels real nice. Like, I'm not gonna hold you guys. I'm gonna take a little bit of a smaller section this time. I feel like that's enough. Yeah, that's a good amount. But look at even with the a lot of product I put, my hair absorbed it. So this, yes, look at that. <laughs> So it does have a firm hold to it. It's a little flaking. I don't know what that's about, but it's flaking a little bit. Um, it's really soft. I just don't know why my hair looks like this, but the roots are kind of hard, so it's not like I could pick it out. Some of my hair is still wet too, so. But this would be a good washing up. I'm not gonna hold you guys. Yeah, I don't know why it's so crunchy. I'm not joking. The thing is, even like with my gel, I don't even experience this, so I don't even know. Lately, I've been having like crunchy roots. Okay, it's coming together a little bit, guys, from these products, and I don't like it. I think I'm just gonna pull my hair up. Cause. It's bouncy, it's not hard. It's, it really is soft, so it's just the roots, in my understanding. 